For any Xbox or PlayStation codes or cheap games on any platform, use the referral link in the description. It'll take you to G2A.com. Use the promo code CHEZ over there and you'll get yourself 3% cash back. For all No Identity merchandise, hats, hoodies and t-shirts, follow the link in the description down below to the No Identity Fan Fiber website. Hey guys, welcome to episode number 49 of the Football Manager stream series here on the channel. Starting a new uh, stream session, so be... Three, four, five, six plus. I've no idea. I'm not. Don't know how long I'm going to stream. But multiple episodes from this particular stream session. In the last one, we were doing actually very well for the first time in a while. When we joined Reading. We won a game and lost a couple. Then won a couple. Then lost. Then won a couple. Then lost. And uh, in January, we completely gutted the team, made 12 new signings, and have gone on a six-game win streak. However, the next game is Southampton in the FA Cup. So I think the win streak might be coming to an end, but hopefully we can continue the unbeaten run in the league. Uh, so we'll just have to wait and see. Drop the video a like if you enjoy. Subscribe to the channel too to make sure you don't miss out on any more. Of course, there's uh, FIFA stuff and the Pez Become a Legend on the YouTube channel. If you want to watch these streams live, links in the description to my Twitch and to my Twitter, where I obviously tweet out, etc. and let you guys know when I'm going to go live, as well as the notification you'll get by following the, uh, the, uh, the Twitch channel. But I'm going to crack on. And uh, divert my attention to my Twitch chat, so we shall uh, we shall crack on from here, and hopefully we'll be able to get ourselves a respectable result against Southampton. I'm not sure how well it's going to go. I'm slightly nervous because, well, we haven't been that good at Reading, but we're in good form, and I, I'd hate for a, a big defeat here to lend itself towards destroying morale and everybody being like, oh, we're just going to lose every week again then. Uh, but apparently, the Southampton manager has been feeling the pressure. I'm not really too sure about that. Uh, I'm just going to say no comment, I think. I seem to dismiss my chance of coming out on top. Uh, I'll leave the talking to him. I don't want to get called into uh, or drawn into any sort of media battles. Uh, I don't know about that. Uh, it's going to... Yeah. Reading's last meet with Southampton was a fair was a fair while ago now. Was that in the full match details? Are not available for this fixture. Oh, okay, great. Uh, I would say we'll consider us outsiders for this one because obviously we are. Your side so far has pushed three opponents to the wayside, but now face a tougher challenge. Can a fourth follow? Well, I've only been in charge for one FA Cup game, and that was a slim one nil victory over Shrewsbury. Uh, acknowledge that it's going to be tough for us. I think we'll just see what happens. I, I, I don't know, man. They're they're pretty good. I don't I don't really know what's gonna happen. Do 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 do. Let me just turn sound on for FM. Okay. Sunderland beat Liverpool by three goals to one, though. Tell him, man, seventeen just subscribed for the very first time with Twitch Prime. Thank you, mate. Welcome to the club. Thank you for a brand new subscription. Uh, the board are very pleased with us at present. The well, let's have a look at the dynamics, shall we? The match cohesion is good. The dressing room atmosphere is good, although there are players that want to leave, and I wasn't able to sell them on in January. And man managerial support is average. I've made several of the players unhappy. Well, the majority of the players are unhappy. I didn't make unhappy. They were already unhappy, so not my fault. Anyway. The board in general. Taking the world over. Thank you for the donation. I'll check that in just a moment. Our job is actually very secure right now at 68%. Because we've managed the finances well, the tactics apparently they're really pleased with. And uh, in general, a competition performance, they wanted a mid table finish and we currently. Uh, or they wanted a top half table finish. They expect us to push for the playoffs, but I don't think that's going to happen. But still. Uh, we've improved the team a lot since we took over. When we joined Reading, they were 20th. Now we're 7th. Although after the round of League One fixtures that are going on right now, on Saturday the 1st, we will drop a couple of places, I would expect. Uh, we had a £5 donation from Leone. Thank you very much. Just haven't been able to catch a stream for a bit. Thought I'd donate. Hope you've had a good day. I haven't streamed for a bit, actually, Leone. So don't worry, you haven't missed anything. But thank you for the donation. And I have had a good day. I hope you have too. Now, I'm interested to see where we drop to in the league after uh, 
after this round of fixtures. Ninth. We've dropped two places. Look, we were seventh. We dropped to ninth, but that's fine. We're only four points off the playoffs, actually. But let's not get too far ahead of ourselves. The side have been absolutely woeful for the majority of the season. It's only briefly that we've had any sort of decent form put together. And I want to get past this game against uh, Southampton before doing anything else or getting too far ahead of us. But Tamiku's just subscribed for four months in a row. Wish you, wish you all good to 2018. Thank you very much for the New Year wishes, my man. Same to you and everybody else, obviously, that's here. How do you ask for a senior affiliate? What you do is you go board, you go make board request, networking, and then ask for senior affiliate. I don't have it as an option here because I already have a senior affiliate. A senior affiliate is Chelsea. So I can't ask for one. But because I've already got one. Can you donate with Maestro? Uh, I don't know. I presume so. Grills, I presume so. If you follow the link and you'll be able to see, it'll give you all of the different um, options. A brand new subscription from Hardcore Larpa. Thank you very much for the uh, brand new sub. Welcome to the club. Happy New Year. You've been noticed, Dan. Don't worry. <laughs> Cheers. Notice me. Notice me. Give me attention. Uh. A senior affiliate is a uh, larger team that can then send uh, loan players to you free of charge. Like, you'll be able to get them without having to give them any sort of monthly fee or pay any of their wages. You're the senior affiliate, and you have affiliated clubs like uh, feeder clubs almost. As you can see here, we have uh, a number of uh, smaller affiliate clubs. We can send loan players to them. They can get loan players from me free of charge, etc. Yeah, but we actually get an, an annual fee from Chelsea of £107,000, which is nice. It's not going to make too much difference, but hundred grand's hundred grand, isn't it? So... See what happens. Uh, if it isn't listed on the list, Grills, then uh, I'm afraid I presume not. If it's just PayPal and Visa and the normal ones, then uh, I guess my show isn't available. I apologise. Keep your money. <laughs> I very much appreciate the uh, your want to donate, but you might as well keep your money, mate. <laughs> Spend it on yourself in this new year. Right, now I can't play a couple of people that I would very much like to play in this game. So, they're cup tied, so we will head into the game against Southampton here with not my full strength side, but it's still strong enough. Let me check that donation just as we head into the game. I'm going to say calmly, uh, it's all over to you now, have a good one. Oh, it's all going off. Reese with the 19 month subscription, have my money, he says. Thank you very much, Reese. I shall put it towards my rent. And we had a £1 donation from James. Says, hello, Chez, but her Arsenal fan here. Well, you got a 2 2 draw. You can't be too butt hurt. You'd been more butt hurt if Alvaro Morata had finished that one on one. Uh, in good form, do you think? Complacency? They're... Yeah. They're a... How are we going to get complacent against the Premier League side? I mean, come on. Right, let's see how we get on. I'd be happy with anything smaller than a, or anything at the same level as the same level as or smaller than a two-goal defeat. To be honest, like two nil, three one, four two. Maybe not like seven five. That might be a bit too much. They're playing a strong side as well. and Shakiri. You're looking 3 0 Southampton, do you, Nate? Find out. Let me know in the chat what your. Oh, pardon me. What your uh, expectations are. Admiral for the win! That, it says it's a fresh subscription, but I know that it's not. Thank you very much for your continued support, my man. 
must have just gone past the uh, the month period from your previous one and not actually counted the streak. Apparently we are looking complacent out there. What is going on? How can we be looking complacent against a team like Southampton? I'd rather you didn't, lads, if you don't mind. The majority of you expecting a Southampton win, as do I. Thank you, my man. All the best in 2018 for you too. They've got, hey, look, they've got Tony Sanabria up top. Shout out Antonio Sanabria. Oh, he's going to score against me here, isn't he? Shout out Antonio Sanabria. Terrible mistake from Adam Federici. Punished. We'll skip that one. I don't really want to watch that again. Thank you very much. He's going to score again now, like two minutes later, isn't he? Oh, he's going to hit the post two minutes later. <laughs> I'd like to avoid embarrassment, if we can, but I don't mind losing. But even just having a shot would be nice, perhaps, in this first half. I'm so dank with the nine months in a row. Let's see you win the league, Chez. I'd like to win the league. Not going to happen this season, but who knows. If we end up staying in League One and staying at Reading, there's no reason why we can't strengthen again in the summer and push for the league title. We're not, not re I'm not really expecting to achieve too much in this first season at Reading. I'm just wanting to kind of have equalised. I'm just wanting to kind of assert myself on the squad and then we'll build on it. Four months in a row for I get crowd, says Doot. <laughs> Thank you, mate. I do keep jinxing myself. You're right. I jinx myself all the time. Uh, no, I won't be releasing Sanabria from Roma. <laughs> Although he does get dropped from one of the two, uh, one of the three games in tomorrow's episode, so... Oh, shit! We got right at the other end and scored. Cheers, then. 2-1 Southampton. There we go, he's your production. <laughs> LOL. If you'd like to subscribe to Automatic, then feel free to follow that link in the chat. I don't know what's picked up or not. Is he alright? What is it? Potential lower leg injury. He's going to make it to half time. I'll take him off. He's not actually having that good a game. I'll take him off. And half time. This is the FA Cup, Daniel. Yeah, fourth round. I'm going to calmly say I expect to see much better of in the second half, and then we'll take Alex Mauer out. And who do we put in in his place? <laughs> Can Richie Tower play further forward? He can. Not that well, though. But he's got 14 finishing, you know. I'm going to try, I'm going to try Richie Tower there. And then we'll take Mauer out for Jordan Much. Basically just avoiding bringing on Sone Aluko, to be completely honest. Uh, that's the best position we can find for Richie Tower. We'll see if he gets on a little bit further forward. Fortnite or World War Two? I'd say Fortnite. I l absolutely love Fortnite. I haven't played it for a few days, actually. In fact, I don't think I've played it this year. I haven't played. I haven't played anything but FIFA to record or FM all year. I haven't touched Fortnite. I haven't touched any other game. Oh, Pez as well, obviously, for recording. What am I clicking updates for? It's not what I want to click on whatsoever. Go away. Click on that. Come on, the boys. Might take Sam Smith off in a minute and bring Sonia Luca on. No, I said I didn't really want to, but Sam Smith isn't having a very good game. 
And whilst I can't play Will Grigg or Danny Rose because they're both cup tied, I might as well make some change. Could even maybe move Modu Barrow up top, but it's probably not the best of ideas. In before mistake that leads to a third goal. Oh, wait! Never mind. Playing as much FIFA as I do would ruin you. Oh look, mistake that led to a third goal. It did happen in that highlight, just not exactly at the moment I thought it would. Well, maybe Barrow can play at top. He's probably only good as a Czech or t and he's not that good. He's bloody fast though. 18 acceleration, 19 pace. Ah, uh, bring on some of the why not? And there's a poacher. I said I'd take a two-goal defeat, so that's what we've got on our hands at the minute, although I have a feeling they might be about to extend that lead. No. Sone Lupe has been played through one-on-one. -on -one. He's only just on the pitch, and he misses the target. I probably could have called that. You failed to your bit there, Foxy. Oh, there you go. You got it second time around. <laughs> if the score could stay as it is, please. Jordan Much has come off the bench and done um, dick all. And there's a fourth. Come on. I expected to lose this anyway, so it's fine. Uh, hi. What's my ideal transfer for Reading? Uh, Messi. Get in the bin. Don't make it five. Thanks. Come on, lads, let's get one back, shall we? Good ball. There are people in the middle. Oh my god, Sone Luco did a goal. I don't believe it. He actually can score. I'd never have believed it if you hadn't if you'd have told me. getting a little bit cocky now, cheering every time they make a completed pass. And 5-2? No. Commando! Thank you very much for this two months in a row, my man. I think this is just going to be the final highlight, isn't it? It's just going to run out until the final whistle. I wonder how good Antonio Sanabria is on FM. I'll have a look after this game. Say goodbye to the FA Cup. See you next year. <laughs> As the final whistle goes, goodbye FA Cup. See you next year. Antonio Sanabria got man the match. He looks alright, actually. They've paid 16 million for him and have only started him three times, although they literally just bought him in January, so he's got two assists in the in the Premier League. Now he's got two goals as well. Seems like a good signing for Southampton, Antonio Sanabria, well done. Uh, assertively, it was just one of those days. We'll try and keep morale up so we can keep going in the league. Now he's out for seven days to two weeks, that sucks, because he's been superb for us since coming in. Uh, bitterly disappointed. Uh, wasn't good enough. I did say that at half-time. Uh, they can play however they want. Not sure there's anything we can do. 
Uh, Lambert Bakula wasn't going to change that game. Sanabri was great. What could I do? What could I do against Antonio Sanabri in that situation? We shall continue. We've got Wigan next. Well, I don't know what formation to play against Wigan. What formation was I playing in these games? Was I playing 4 4 2? I wasn't. I was playing 4 2 3 1. 4 2 3 1. 4 2 3 1. 4 2 3 1. Yeah. But without Alex Mauer, I'm going to go 4 4 2, I think. So I just don't have a cam. Alex Mauer is my only option at cam. I've been playing 4 4 2 in my off stream Rangers save. It's going quite well, but obviously I'm Rangers and I'm in the SPL, so it's not overly difficult. Uh, Horgan is a player I am still definitely keen on next season. So we'll keep him on the short list. Dean Gallen, he's that youngster at Chelsea, isn't he? He's not the one I was thinking of. I'm going to discard him. The author, I'm going to discard. Will Patching, no. Paul Downing, I'll acknowledge. Frankie Kent, <sighs> discard. Jake Cooper was someone I was uh, keen on. Jason Lowe, discard. George Saunders, I'll keep scouting. Alex Pierce. Uh, I don't know whether I'd be open to bringing him back to the club or not. I'm going to say no. Be better off with uh, younger talents, wouldn't we? David Myler. Sorry, Dave. It's going to be a no from me. Say no to Shut Finley. Don't know anything about Stankovic yet. We'll continue to scout him. No. 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 Eh. Billy Gilmore on loan at Ch oh on loan from Chelsea sorry. Let's get a on him. John Bostock still on my shortlist. Still would be a player I'd consider bringing in. With his Grove still a player I consider bringing in as well. Obviously we're we're not in a transfer window won't be for months so it doesn't matter right now. Uh, it's like your judgment Britain's got talent, all these scout reports. It's a no from me. Sorry, David. <laughs> okay, cheers, Sonia Luco. How about you just shut up? How's that sound, eh? Good to me. Uh, I do still have Alfredo Morelos in my Rangers save. Yes, he's my second top goal scorer this season. I'm not in a transfer window, Billy. Can't sign anyone. Also, please don't spam in caps. Thanks. They can play a 4 4 2. Now, we have just signed their top, or their previous top goal scorer in a certain William Grigg, who's been banging them in for Wigan and scored one in three for me and actually hasn't been playing that well. But. It might just take him a, a little while to settle, so it's fine. Who did I start with in the Rangers save? Um, oh, Chris Gunter's injured. Oh, it's only three days, that's fine. I started at Blackburn, and then went from Blackburn to Borussia Mucci and Gladbach, then from Borussia Mucci and Gladbach to Sevilla, and then from Sevilla to Rangers. And Sevilla were the only side that I got sacked from. I won the league, won league one at Blackburn, season one. Then left them halfway through the season to go straight into Borussia Mucci and Gladbach job. Then left Borussia Mucci and Gladbach at the end of season two to go straight into the Sevilla job. Got sacked from Sevilla in like the February or March of season three. Then finished the season at Rangers season three. And I'm now just come out of the January transfer window, I think, in season four. I think I'm... I think I'm February or March season four. It might be. I think I'm close to my one year anniversary as manager of Rangers. Uh, 
Uh, I applied for all of them, Dan. I did, in fact, just get headhunted at Rangers and had uh, Brighton, who were 19th in the Premier League, approach me for an interview, but I declined it. I want to at least finish the season I'm in at Rangers and try and win the SPL and maybe the Cup as well. Oh, no, actually, I think I'm out of the Cup. Well, try and win the SPL and get at least another piece of silverware on my... Uh, CV before moving on. Obviously, the only piece of silverware I've got on my CV at the minute in that save is uh, the League One title with Blackburn. I didn't win anything. Win, I didn't win anything else with them that season, and I didn't win anything at Borussia, Borussia Gladbach or Sevilla. So I'd like to win something at Rangers before I leave, preferably the League title. But we'll have to wait and see what happens. Right now, we have Wigan, and they're in fair form. We're in strong form. Wigan are fourth in the table, though. We've played them once so far. Well, the club has played them once so far this season and lost. Uh, right back. There's Chris Gunter in a right back, but you can go as an attacking fullback. And then Ryan Shotton and Richard Keogh will be my centre backs. Thank you very much, Stopper. Left back. Oh, who do I go with at left back? I'm actually. Do I give Jordan a beat or a run out at left back? Do I stick with Tyler Black? I'm going to stick with Tyler Blackett. Right hand side of midfield. Go on there, Leandro Bakuna. You can go out there. Uh, Diva Divas and Richie Towell. And then on the left we'll go Mate. Just because he's been quite good, actually, since we brought him in. Uh, up top, no surprise, we're going to go Will Grigg and Danny Rose. Advanced forward. And Danny Rose. Defensive forward, supportive. I mean, on the bench, uh, Jamal Blackman. Why is everybody not in... Why is everybody not in position order? What's that all about? I bet if I click position, it will mess this up, won't it? What? Normally when this is sorted like this, they're all in position order here. Why, how do I fix that, chat? I bet if I go to my tactics screen. They're not in position order here either. Oh, my OCD doesn't like that. Actually, no, they are in position order here. No, they're not. Yeah, they are. Yeah, they are in position order in my tactics, but on the su submit team screen, they're not. What? I don't like. It used to be in. It used to be in position order. I don't like that. Don't like that one bit. Uh, Modi Barrow can go on the bench. Uh, Matt Crooks can go on the bench. Hold shift to have a secondary sorting, really? Shift. <gasps> My man! Shout out to... Hang on, I can't actually read your name with the way that it is. Shout out to Yelda. You have saved my life. I put Sam Wilson on the bench actually. Oh, he might. Can he play? How good is he? Ooh. Ooh, I am sorely tempted actually to play him. Yeah. Yeah! Let's do Yeah! Why not? I'll give him his debut over here on the left. Play him as a supportive wide midfielder. Ooh. That's changed things round a bit. Uh, and then Sam Smith on the bench. Striker, I've got a wide player, two wide players. Centre mid. Da, 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 da. Submit team, let's go. Do, 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 do. 44. It could be Lewis Hamilton for the day. Dressing room. Um, passionately. 
avenge what happened last time. Here we go, kick off. Let's go, boys. Playing in our orange and black away kit. I'll just save these emails. Oh, that was. I don't know if Facebook would be more than that. Go away, Facebook. Go on, up we go, Will. Oh, great first touch. Will Grigg, ladies and gentlemen, gets us off the mark after six minutes. That is exactly, and he's not too shy either about celebrating in front of his former fans. He's run immediately over to celebrate. What a first touch, by the way, to just pluck this out of the air. Bosch takes it past the goalkeeper and squeezes it to in, in at the near post and runs off immediately to celebrate in front of the home fans. How to make yourself a villain immediately. Will Brigg. What well, hero. I really want them to become to became yeah. I really want them to become quite the partnership, Will Brigg and Danny Rose, hopefully. Sure who they've replaced Will Grid with in their starting lineup. Go on, Danny. There you go. Look, linking up with each other for Will Grid to immediately lose the ball. Although, oh, it's two. That's the partnership we were talking about. Will Grigg with a goal and an assist whips in a great ball to the near post and Danny Rose puts it home. Your sub didn't come through. Um, when did you sub, Bales? When did you sub? Because nothing's come up in the chat and it doesn't it doesn't say anything on my streamlabs either. Will Grigg's on fire. Your defence is terrifying. You have to sing it in a Wigan accent, you see. Or a Northern Irish accent, but I can't do a Northern Irish accent. I certainly very pleased, lads. Keep it going. GG. Hey, Damo. Will Griggs on fire. Your defence is terrified, Will Griggs on fire. Your defence is terrified, Will Griggs on fire. Da -da 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 the strike! They hit the bar, it's fine. <laughs> oh, trust, when that song gets stuck on your head, that's it, you're done for for the rest of the day. Contemplating making a defensive change as we give away a penalty. Shit. Come on, Federici. Okay. Oh, Connor Washington, former Peterborough player. Federici makes the save. Right, let's make a change. Um, don't know what change to make. I know what to make, I know what to make a change, but I don't know which one to do. Let's bring Modi Barrow on the right hand side. And actually uh, I'm tempted to switch to a four two three one again, but no, I won't. We'll just leave Modi Barrow where he is. I could I, I tend not to like to do this, but I might put just put Modi Barrow there. I tend not to like to miss a match formations or put people slightly out of position just because it just, my brain doesn't like it. Can you stop? Well, I mean, you can keep shooting from distance if you're going to shoot wide, but. Oh, me. Hey, Ashley. 
Yeah, I guess he does have an assist. Yeah, he does. He actually counted it as an assist. I guess it, it was, wasn't it? He punted it all the way up to Will Brigg, who buried it. David Davis has got himself booked and he's quite tired, so let's take him off the crooks, who could be the ball-winning midfielder. It's a like-for-like -like change. You subbed 15 minutes ago. Um, nothing's come through, I'm afraid, my man. In the in the top of the chat, you should have the opportunity. You should have the option. Will Grigg! Finish. You should have the option to announce it. Are you on PC or on mobile, Bales? If you're on PC, at the top of the chat, you should have the uh, the option to share your subscription. If you do that, then it will trigger the notification. If you're on mobile, then I think it might just be hiccup in the software, and I apologise. There's not really too much I can do about it, man. embarrassing. I don't know how that's ended up in the back of the net, but we've conceded. Yeah, try refreshing. Like Seb says. There goes our clean sheet. Never mind. This will be fine a whistle. The unbeaten league run continues. The winning league run continues. I'm going to say passionately, I'm very pleased with that. We were ninth. Has that moved us up the table at all? Yeah, the man on the line literally just stood there and watched it go in, didn't he, Fruit Punch? Uh, no, we stay ninth. Okay, fair enough. We are only two points off the playoffs now. Hey, there you go. It let you do it. Thank you very much for the two-month resub, Bales. We needed to do is refresh. Thanks, mate.